We're at the Albion Hotel in South Melbourne. We had a devastating fire uh, in October 2015, uh, two weeks prior to our uh, to opening. Um, as a result of the fire, it gave us the opportunity to uh, start again and redesign the building from the ground up. Uh, we wanted something like a bit of a lifestyle venue that would trade, you know, from lunchtime through to 5 a.m. We wanted to build a rooftop bar that would um, give us the opportunity to, to have the amazing city views that we have here in South Melbourne. So we flipped the design and we put the offices and all of the um, back of house and services on the ground floor. And then uh, level one was to be a, a lounge that could morph into a nightclub um, through, through lighting and then to go up another level and build a rooftop bar. So we've got the only rooftop bar in Victoria, licensed till 5 a.m. Melbourne's weather, um, you know, can be four seasons in one day. So, you know, people in Victoria and people in Australia love a rooftop bar. So it was important when designing the rooftop that uh, it could open up uh, during summer. But then during the inclement weather times, we, we've got um, screens that can shut it off. Uh, we've got ample heating, which can close the venue down and make it nice and warm, even in the middle of winter. We went with Bromic because I like the, the ambience that the heaters give out. You know, it's not a, a really strong red glow, and I think it's important when you, in designing a place that when you spend so much time on ambience and lighting, that you don't want your heaters to change the mood so much of the rooms. They're, they're a great heater because they, they put out a lot of heat but they also blend in nicely with the aesthetics uh, of what we've tried to create on the rooftop. We're extremely proud to, you know, to have created something that's been so well received by not only the locals in South Melbourne, but I think you know, entertainment seekers and, um, and the broader community have really embraced the Albion in our first month. Um, we've got a long way to go, but we're really excited for the future.